What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. Oh, hey, Montreal. I was just jamming to my tunes. I'm your host and best friend, Alex Melky, and this is Anchorman MTL. <laughs> So this past week has been substantially f***ed up in Montreal's metro system. First a woman gets strangled after her scarf gets caught in an escalator going down into the Fabra metro station. Then a man gets stabbed in Lionel Gru. And the most recent uh, series of STM mysteries, a woman was wandering the metro tunnels between Sherbrooke and Mount Royal. She gets hit by a metro car. What the f*** is going on? A Scotiabank on Decarry was robbed. A man was shot dead after he tried robbing an armored vehicle in Longueuil. And a man was also shot dead by Montreal police after he was bashing a dude brains in with a hammer. What is this, Gotham City? Check out mtlblog.com for the latest updates on what the f*** is going on in this city. In case you were too busy having a life outside the internet, you're aware of something called Bitcoin, but no actual clue as to what the f*** it is. Can I eat it? Can I wear it? Bitcoin is a digital currency. Think internet bucks, only now in the real world. They're gonna start popping up Bitcoin ATMs all over the f***ing place. Think Starbucks, but cash money money. One currency to rule them all. Check out the full list of Montreal stores that are starting to accept this online currency from the future at mtlblog.com. Lynn Chaloux doesn't like zombies. The director of a charity that helps immigrants out decided to bring that to the Bill 60 hearings last week. Yeah, no, get this, all right? She saw a zombie walk in Paris one time, peed her pants. We're talking about a grown ass woman here, grow up! There's one that happens in Montreal every year and she's saying it's a no-no. And then she started hating on Mormons. I can't remember if they're the ones with 10 wives and a special on TLC or is that the Amish? Anyways, the point is she wants them to get the f*** out of Quebec because apparently they're always trying to convert people. Look lady, this is in the 1940s. Mormons have rights now. Calm the f*** down. Driving in the city isn't that easy. You've got to deal with psychotic drivers, pedestrians with a death wish, cyclists who just don't give a f and falling debris. It's a bird, it's a plane, it's an overpass. Potholes are the creme de la creme of Montreal road f ups. Well, photographers Claudia Ficha and her husband David Luciano devised an evil plan to make something super shitty seem not so bad. Check out their full creative works at mtlblog.com because it is super sweet. Montreal Mayor Denis Coderre is gangster as f He decided to take a stand against homophobia in Russia by putting up a gay pride flag in the city hall. Now look, right now, he's f***ing taking the fight to Sochi. Soki? Sochi? Goddamn, this is played and plaid all over again. On a lighter note, Miley Cyrus is naked again. Is that something people still care about? Yes, it is. You know how I know? Because you're going to go check it out on mtlblog.com right after you finish watching this video. Now look, her boobies are all over the goddamn place. This time, they made their way into German Vogue. I'm a blonde angel, tweeted Miley Cyrus. Vater, Vater, come look. Miley Cyrus is naked again. Oh, there goes my Wiener Schnitzel. Now, every week on mjblog.com, we like to find the best Instagram pictures that showcase this city. And this week, Instagrammer Mr. Verdu took a crazy shot of the Olympic Stadium off in the distance. It shows a crazy sense of scale. Check out his account. And make sure to check out mjblog's account as well. And the next time you're out there snapping a pic, make sure you hashtag it mtlblog and you might just make next week's video. Make sure to check out mtlblog.com for bullshit facts that are actually true, how to beat your friends at Flappy Bird, what to watch on Canadian Netflix, and the latest and greatest of what this city has to offer. I'm out of here! I got, I, I really, I have to go. No, I gotta go. I got, fine, one autograph. God.